Hello everybody and welcome. Today we're going to be playing some Hogwarts Legacy from the very beginning of the game on a new character. I hope you're all having a fantastic day and hyped for the game. I want to say thank you to Warner Bros Games for providing us with a code so we can play and bring you guys this gameplay and additional content and guides that you can expect over the next few days. We've got some very excited things in the works. But as you can see, we have our Hogwarts Witchcraft and Wizardry basically like our invitation to join Hogwarts as a fifth year student. We'll be going in as a fifth year, which is very unorthodox, but we'll learn more about why and how and all of that and how everything uh, everything works. So I think we should uh, jump into it. And as we progress through, such as our character creation that we'll jump into now, if you guys would like, we can do some polls and we can... Uh, we can see if you, you know, what character you guys want us to make. I do like to do a poll and uh, have the community drive things. How is it going, Nithin? Uh, just want to be very, very helpful if you guys can let me know if there's any audio issues. So if you can hear me and you can hear the game, please do let me know in chat uh, so we can stay on top of things. The game is coming out very, very soon, though. I believe it's going to be playable for most people tomorrow, if you're watching this live. If you have the uh, the early access. <laughs> How is it going, everyone? How are we able to play it? We got a code from Warner Bros. Games, which we're very appreciative for. So uh, we're finally able to show to you guys. That is correct. That is correct. So uh, let's do a poll for if we should make a witch or a wizard. What do you guys think? Let's do a little poll. Shall we be a, a witch or a wizard? So the game is coming out on PC, PlayStation and Xbox, uh, but we shall be playing on PC today. Uh, I am going to, however, be using a uh, controller. I feel like the game plays very well on a controller. It feels a bit more natural, uh, but we are on PC. How is it performance wise? I have to say I haven't done any explicit benchmarking or anything like that, uh, but I have had I've had no issues. I feel like I do pick up on things like frame rate drops. Maybe there's been the occasional frame rate drop, but nothing that's immersion breaking or game breaking. Uh, you know, it's very uh, it feels very solid, but I do have a very good PC as well. So it might depend on your PC. Looks like people are voting. The votes are coming through. Are we being a witch or a wizard? A lot of votes coming in for Wizard. Not gonna lie, guys. I thought uh, from our previous games, you guys have always voted to go for the a female character. So I'm very, very surprised. Looks like we're going male today. Well, well, well. The the poll is in. The the votes are out. Let's go for a wizard. You're a wizard, Harry. <laughs> All right, uh, we've got a few. All right, we've got a few, quite a few different wizard options here. There's some really good options. They're all quite different as well, you know. Which one should we go for? Oh, I like the hair on. The, I like the hair on this guy. All right, there's so many presets. You know what? We want to get into the juicy parts of the game. Let's just uh, let's let's blast through, shall we? Uh. Uh, let's have a look. What have we got face-wise? Look at the jawline on this guy. Come on, we're in. We're going to. Uh, we're going to Hogwarts. We need some. Uh, we need some glasses, right? Look at this. It's straight. Look at these ones. They straight up block his eyes. <laughs> All right, let's blast through. I have to say, I do. I like the hair. Maybe can we go a little lighter? A little lighter, maybe. Oh, gee. Wait a minute. We got all kinds of hair options. All right, we'll go with this. Any scars and markings? Uh, a few freckles. Complexion. Maybe a little, a little bit. A little battle scar. Can we get like a... <laughs> Can we get the Harry Potter lightning bolt? 
We'll get a scar across the eye. You know, we've seen things. We've seen things. The Brad Pitt looking wizard. <laughs> How's it going, everybody? Welcome. I will say we have actually uh, been playing and we have we have beat the game. Uh, so I can give you guys non-spoiler related questions if you want to know about any mechanical things or just generally about the game. I'm happy to answer any of your guys' questions. Just drop them in the chat. And of course, guys, everybody, if you enjoy these streams, if you enjoy the gameplay and everything that we bring you, definitely click like down below. That's how we track if you guys are enjoying uh, the streams. And if you guys enjoy them, we'll do more of them. So let me know if you guys want more streams like this and we'll, uh, we'll uh, hook you guys up. Uh, do shout out any options that you see that you want me to go for, but I'm thinking we just want to like we just want to get into the game. Am I right? I think we're pretty pretty good overall. We got it voice one. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. We got voice two. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Whoa. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. That was quite something. Hey, well. Uh, so we play on, should we play on normal, guys? Or hard, should we play on hard, normal, easy? Can we get a quick... Uh, put in chat quickly. I'm not going to do a poll, but just put your... Or, I mean, I guess even story. Put your difficulty choice in the chat, and I'll go through a quick chat consensus. Uh, while you guys do that, uh, let me... Uh, let's put in the name. Let's put in the old... The old name. Uh, we got we got a lot of normals. We got a lot of hards. It actually looks like there's more normals. We're gonna go with normal then. I guess most people are gonna play on normal anyway. So you guys want to see how it goes. I think we're ready. I think we're here. We don't. We're not wasting too much time on the character creator. You guys voted for wizard, so I think we should we should start start our journey off to Hogwarts. It appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spell His we face. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. I've got to say, I'm... Um... I am impressed with the graphics <laughs> and just the character faces George. and stuff. Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> Is there transfiguration? It's been much too long. When I received you, your owl, I What exactly say I do you mean by transfiguration? Not speak here, Eleazar. Hmm? Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get the to. Sorting ser idea. Guys, we're going to do a poll for what house you guys think we should pick. tagging along? Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be when we get to, to it, we'll do a poll for which house rocks. we're going to pick. Oh, transforming into other people? Not that I've encountered, but I've... Not that I've encountered. Look at it go! I want to let you guys know right now, in terms of sound and music and sound effects, in terms of graphics, I'm very impressed overall. I feel like music is a massive thing in games that's underrated. And if they nail the music and the sound effects, it hits different. Uh, this is on PC. Scotland. <laughs> Just so barely. buggy, you can't even. The horses don't even load. Oh, you and don't know about the. You don't know your companion. Harry Potter lore. Your Wizarding a World new lore. Student. New. Does anyone in chat yes, know why we can't see how the cart is flying? How extraordinary! 
It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked the character's faces are done so well. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the ministry. <laughs> The chat Have you guys you know, this? you only see Thestrals if you've seen death. I have. And we're just, Opinions we're just differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? Look at the character's How? eyes. She wrote to me about Ranrock before she died. Wondering I want to cast guys, I want to show you guys some activities. spell casting. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eliazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. Keep it secret. I cannot open it. Keep it safe. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Are you able to play on Steam with PS4? I don't see why not. I mean, I'm playing with a with a 360 controller. Merlin's or no. beard. How did you wait? I'm just playing with a normal Xbox controller. Jeez! Hang on! Yo, look at this dragon! That guy's got chomped. Yo, who, who said you guys were wondering if you could see the Thestrals or yeah. not? Yo, that's such a good scene. The key! Give me your hand! Accio! Oh, he just accioed the key towards him. There, okay, I have to. I. I. I oh, jeez. There's so many little things in this Are that you if you guys right? love, like, the Wizarding World. <sighs> And, you know, different charms and different, maybe the Perhaps sound effects from the movies and stuff. Oh my god. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Have a little chug of a Wigan World Potion. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... What the George hell just got, got into that chomped by a dragon? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was Please clearly Please tell me this game key. is good. I've been kind of hyped and I'm scared. An item enchanted to well, bring whoever touches it to a specific stick around. place. You'll find out. We're going to play for a few hours. We're going to show you guys the beginning of the game. I'm feeling better, sir. If you like to look around a bit i would the graphics but stay close we've no idea who created this port key or why the lighting is really good as well i'm in control Ooh. is it available ps5 i believe it is i believe it will be Yo, look at this. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage travelled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins, 
Do you think the port key was meant to lead us there? But we accio that port key, this which just teleported us to like this, us this random but cave. But sent that port key to George for a reason, and I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find hey. a path, however faded it may be. All right. Oh, we can run now. Step. Where do you suppose your wife Shout got the, the professor key that us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. By the way, guys, if you don't know, I'm uh, Paradise, part of Arius Gaming, and I see a few people asking about the house magic. choice. We're going to do yes. a poll. When a we get to that point, I'm going to let you guys choose. We'll do a chat poll. Seems to have been lost to time. And do remember, guys, if you like the streams and you want more streams, from us then just hit the like button and let me know in the comments or in the chat and we'll do more because i really i really enjoyed Hogwarts doing these Castle streams with you guys by, and, uh, is and we'll do more of them if you guys like them too that ancient magic i don't know where she came into possession of the port key but i am certain it was to do with that search ah oh, there's the path down below this way but sir why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke you of the, the animations on the do. clothes. Wait but until magic you see is this. No different there's than any scarves, power. there's capes, there's what robes. What really matters is the one who Hats wields as well. it. Ooh. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. How's the game so far? So far it's been epic. If you guys have just joined in the last couple minutes, you missed out on the most <laughs> the most epic thing ever. That was a dragon. Ooh. Yo, that excellent. You tell me that magic didn't look amazing. So basically, you you can use your right analog stick, uh, and it will dynamically like target with an outline, uh, like the enemy that you're most centered on. Oh, cool slide! That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. How do you feel the magic on Dual Sense? So I'm I'm using an Xbox controller, so uh, I don't know, but I. Ah, I hope it's up good. There. Little traversal good. aspects. All right, guys, you know me. I love my exploring. So we got a. Ooh. Oh, we got that money. Oh, hold. Yo, I'm destroying every pot that we find. We're close now. It's just ahead. Wanna pew pew the pots? Steady yourself. Is there any uh? Reparo! Any rubies in the pots? All right, Professor Fig showing off. Hitting us with the Reparo. You hope this is just the beginning of an awesome journey with this game and future updates? Me too, my friends. I hope this is the beginning of, a, of an awesome series of games. That's what I hope. I'm, destro I'm destroying the pops. Why would someone do this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. Ooh, the basic attacks let look nice. Here for a reason. Any more pots Let's have for a me? Look around for anything that seems the particle effect. Place. Really nice. Yeah. 
Oh, we got the mini map. Okay, so. What's over here? Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Hmm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Ooh. We did have a little frame drop there. Hit that pop. Little statue over here. Professor, this statue. This may have been his home. How are we on early? Today is the day that we can finally share the game with you. We got the code early from Warner Bros. Games. And you can expect plenty of content over this next week, guys. And we have a very exciting guide for you later today that's going to get you... Like, if you're ready to play Hogwarts Legacy and you want to get brushed up as a beginner and you want to learn everything we've learned from finishing the game, you need to stay tuned on the channel for this guide later on. It's going to give you everything you need to know as a beginner without any spoilers. I love how the pots just explode. But I want my rubies. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? Oh, I want it. Oh, What's guys. This? Start in the game. Fig. I think if you... I, I have to say... Especially the first, like five hours if you're a fan of the wizarding world like and you just enjoy you know how odd why would someone have Hogwarts conjured that the enchanted music and the stone field? here oh my gosh and how is there a room behind it what room i don't see anything there's that glow again like the glow on the port key container what in merlin's name Rick's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Yo, they just hit us with the magic. So yeah, it's 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 R2 to do a like a basic attack. But we haven't got our spells yet, but we'll get those. We'll get those soon. Hello? Is it just me or does your, your character sound like Harry Potter? So, yeah, the voice option one, I think they've picked him. It's it's not Daniel Radcliffe, but they've picked him, I think, because he does he does pronounce things very similar. It can't be. That's right. Uh, so, like, uh, like Itchy's saying in chat, tomorrow will be the... It will be playable early tomorrow with the Deluxe Edition. But the actual release is on the 10th. Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Can you share some information on the Dark Arts Vote and how you get them? 12, I, presume. I would say expect to get Dark Arts like mid to late Precisely. game. You're not going to get them at the beginning. The key? Mm -hmm. Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. We're in Gringotts. This way, then. Yo, yeah, and the music kicks in. After you. How does it seem to you with the game so far? One word. Magical. Uh, keep your hands inside the cart if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> hey, Gian, appreciate it. Yeah, that that is that is a, a very valid criticism. The character creator doesn't have any facial hair options or body size options, How many uh, which I do there? really wish it had. Oh, look at this! In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to Vault I Number got full 12. camera control. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The Vault you Whoa, see now the it's got gyro. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. 
Yes, so I am on a PC, but I am you using an Xbox controller. I a think what? if you want to play this game, uh, my personal opinion that is it feels it feels enchantment. right on a controller. A and I say that as a keyboard and mouse like main in pretty much most you? games. But this one definitely These feels good to play on a controller. That we're passing now. How deep are we going? We are going number deep. twelve was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded Whoa. over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in, or oh, we've quite a distance to go. Oh, I can't wait till we get to Hogwarts, guys. Vault number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. You know what, uh, Asriel, so you say you can't wait to get your hands on it. You have no knowledge of the games or books, but, the, but it looks amazing and interesting to you. That's a really interesting point, because I'm coming from a background of knowing the books and the movies, right? I actually, I actually Professor, think if you are a fan of the Wizarding World stuff, was there's a lot in here that you're gonna, it's just gonna like tug your heartstrings. No, but if you're not a fan of the Wizarding World and you have no knowledge, yeah, well, I that? still think it's we gonna be like a very engaging and fun game. That's my personal opinion. Rare anyone goes there but I will say, I think there's a lot of things in here for the fans that are like little touches that, if you know, you know, and it and it uh, it just feels good. Here we are. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. Well, in that time, Gringotts. no one has visited Vault 12 until today. So this vault's been sealed for hundreds of years. Ray's, thank you so much for the uh, the donation. He says, do you need, have to pick Slytherin to learn the dark arts? You do not. Vault 12. Thank you for your help. But I will, again, I will say, and I did answer this earlier on, you will not get access to the dark arts and the forbidden curses early game. They're going to be something like mid to late late game, okay? Are the house ghosts in the game? There are many ghosts in the game. What do you suppose we should be looking for? This is on I'm ultra sure. settings, yes. This is on max so, settings. I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Ah, oh, so we're about to learn Revelio, yes, our first a revealing spell. Charm. No time like charm, present. to be more accurate. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? So, Revelio. Oh. And focus. So, this is how you learn spells. So, every spell you learn, you get a little mini game that you have to do. So, you need to guide. You can see me spin the thing. You need to guide the cursor through, like, through the line and press the inputs as you collide with them. Uh, and they'll, like, if you don't go quick enough, you, you fail. But we got this. I'm a seasoned veteran. So now we have access to Revelio. Now, Revelio is more Revelio. like, it's more like a scan. There, I saw so you something. know how some games have a scan Move that lets you like highlight objects around you? That's what Revelio is. So it's less so a spell that you're going to use in... It, you don't really use it in combat and stuff. You use it to highlight things and find hidden things. Like this. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, what do you guys think of I the voice acting? By the way, we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Oh, 
My personal opinion is that the voice acting is, is, is very good, and there's a lot of different characters no and voices fault. and different actors in I the game as well. We need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. With like with the with the, with the, de with the, with the decent to good voice acting Stand and the close. amazing music no and sound design, things go poorly. and then you layer Not that on with really people. nice graphics, the immersion is. Wait till you get to Hogwarts. Uh, the immersion is just so good. He's got his, he's got yeah, he's got Lumos. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Whoa. What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir, I'm fine. You seem to have that caused the floor, on the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, You'd want to but the statue's That's positions right. don't match. So right now Wait, we have a second hand one. When you move, but later the reflection on we'll get our turned own in one. the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. About to learn Lumos. Oh, little corner there. So we have the wand lighting charm, Lumos. So it's been slotted for us automatically. So now we have our first spell. So the way that spell casting works is we can hold right trigger and then use uh, button inputs. Lumos, well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Whoa. He's like the... He's like the, they're like the, uh, the chess statues. Does anyone remember them? Look out! Whoa! Professor, Professor Fig's popping off! Alright, Professor Fig! There's so many. Don't have any spells yet. The counter. He just hit the confringo. Staying close. Professor! Oh, it's a bit dark. Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? Guys. What's happening? The wisps can we listen, of magic can we listen to the sound to effect leading me of somewhere. Lumos, please. Well, the background music's quite loud right now, but can you hear it? Can you hear it? Lumos. I love the sound effect. Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. Magic just looks so good. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Wait, is there a chest down there? Hold Lumos. up. 
Oh, oh. oh they bait it. They're baiting me. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Oh great, we don't have, we don't have Professor Fig. Oh god. Protego, oh, I hit those Protegos. Oh gee. Take that. So you can you can basically tap Y to do your to do your block, but if you hold it, that's how you do the stupefy, which is like a follow-up stun hit. Which is all it's always worth doing. Sling it. Don't even have any other spells yet. Stun lasts really long, it's really good. Yeah, so it's like a parry and a counter attack. Lumos. Whoa. Where's Professor Fig? Revelio. Wait, is there a chat? Can we get the Lumos. chest? Oh, I don't, I don't see it anymore. are amazing so far the soundtrack really yeah. i know this, i i have to say like it it continues to impress through the game as well and the different spells and you know the different areas yo anyone does anyone know what this is we got any knowledgeable lore heads in the chat Thanks, Raze. Yeah, if you guys enjoy the streams, definitely do show support to us by clicking like. It's a great way to let us know that you enjoy these kind of things. And if you do, we'll do more of these streams for you guys. Uh, there you are. How did you... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that M basin. Mtoxify and Znarf, they know that their stuff. That is a mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. If you said pensive, I wonder. Five points to Gryffindor. Follow my lead. So right now we're looking at a memory. All is in place. The port key is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on so this Percival path with powerful here can see with ancient magic. knowledge others will do anything to As obtain. As they just said. Yes. And if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. Asriel, that's correct. That's what you're seeing. So it's a very, it's a very rare gift for a witch or wizard yes, to see sir. ancient magic, like incredibly rare. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had 
always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. So, and you, I believe Fig's seems, wife, Miriam, uh, basically are the key to understanding died. why. Like you said, we trying to uncover something. A moment ago. <laughs> Someone's Which coming. We're now starting to uncover. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, oh, they look at have their the face. Look at the goblin's face. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I, I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have uh, So we've got an early code from one of those games, so that's how we're I playing it. No the game is accessible tomorrow if you have the digital deluxe. Now, uh, otherwise, it will be the tenth of February. Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Oh boy, the, the vault's got a defense system. Well, we'll find out as we play more through it. You can make your, uh, you can make up your own choice. But so far, I've been loving it. That's a thing. Close. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. So he's not right about that goblin. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Alvin, I think I think you I think you will and you will find it a fun adventure. Oh and guys, when you get your broom and you can start flying. And then oh the music. Popping off. Dude, that was legacy. Let's go. We're about. Oh, guys, we're coming up. We're gonna get our. We're gonna be in Hogwarts now. You're confused. Did they get anything from the vault? Well, we got the pensive uh, with the memory in it, right? So we've just learned a bit about this ability to see ancient magic. And we saw Percival. Oh, good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but... Oh, we had some uh, frame rate drops there. More. 
appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket Looks as soon like it's as I can, now, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting It's ceremony? actually really great to do this to do this uh this playthrough because in my initial run these certain frame rate drops weren't happening. So in my personal experience, it could be because I'm streaming. So there's a uh, you know there's extra resources being used to run the streaming software and broadcast it. Uh, because I didn't actually get those frame drops in my initial playthrough. Phineas, Nigellus, Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Fick! It's nice headmaster of you to Simon Pegg. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Yo, they've done such a good job with the details of Hogwarts and in like Professor the Weasley, Great Hall here, for example. One more to be sorted. All right, guys, we're going to be doing Welcome. the poll any minute You're now. Just in time. Have for a what seat. we should sort into. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain it's expectations. Hat. Ooh. I can't wait to start class. Can't wait to explore. We <laughs> want to explore, I'm right? I'm forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Mm. Oh, but you're brave at heart. Mm. Exceptionally. They have done daring, a really good job on the uh, undaunted voice, by the unknown. Willing to forge ahead alone when you must. Perhaps you belong in Gryffindor. Gryffindor, is it? So, we can actually choose our house down here, though. We do have the option to change. So, as promised, we're going to do a poll. So, we've got Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Slytherin, Ravenclaw. Here you go, guys. This is your opportunity to decide our fate. You don't have to put in chat. We've got a poll. Just cast your votes, and the numbers will speak for themselves. Oh, we've got votes for every house coming through so far. I see a lot of Hufflepuffs in the chat. Quite a lot of Ravenclaws too. But so far, a majority Slytherin. I think we're gonna have to be a conniving Slytherin. <laughs> Jihan, do you think? <laughs> The Wizarding World needs a Slytherin protagonist. Well, I think chat agrees with you. You have spoken. And the people want Slytherin. So, 
we're going to go for the house known for cunning ambition and a hunger for power. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. You belong in Slytherin! I think we are getting some frame stutters when I tab out to do the poll. Uh, so... <laughs> so I'm gonna blame that stutter on you guys in chat. I am tabbing out of the game oh, and, I, and, and I am streaming it, remember? One more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. You can't just cancel Quidditch. Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but it was already don't revealed before launch that Quidditch you are would here not be in to the game. focus on your academic and futures. So we can, I'm sure you will have plenty to do blame before the classes master, begin yeah. tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. Oh, it's, it's Professor Weasley. I'm Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. We're going to the Slytherin common room. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. We should have this gone for more slick back hair Slytherin now that we're a uh, Slytherin. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Ooh, the door is so cool. I've not actually been in here, guys. Well done. They might now, have the best entrance, the, the corner sleep. room. I you think we might have to. I tomorrow. think we can all agree I shall on be that. Back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Which command room did I go to before? Before I chose Gryffindor. And I, oh, I loved it inside the Gryffindor common room. It was exactly what you expect and what you'd want it to be. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Oh, let's have a little look around. First of Revelio. all, is there anything in here? No. Even down to the little snakes on the, like, ornating the bed, as you can see here. Oh, yeah, so there's some just... You can just interact with things throughout the world. You can eat apple. There's different things to interact with. Like, you can eat stuff. You can activate certain things. You can spin things. Whoa. Slytherin common room is kind of big. Is this just another, another bedroom? I suppose this common room is very different to Gryffindor's. That new fifth year. Spacious. Different. Starting Hogwarts in your fifth year. I wonder where they're from. They're lucky they didn't end up as dragons. Like that poor man from the ministry. Whoa. Did you see the way they just waltzed in at the end of the sorting ceremony last night? It's just all kind. There's so much detail around the place. Floating. Anyone want some tea? Wait, I actually poured tea? Her face just contorted. You think I just it wasn't just an animation. I find it Is it going to do it again? It actually filled the cup. It works quite well unless he asks me a question and then it's not really a good plan at all. 
Sebastian. Can I help you? Ah, oh, glad you enjoyed uh, Sean. Year. And remember, I'm guys, Sebastian we will be Sala. having a welcome to Slytherin. Having a guide Thank coming you. out later today. Not everyone has a ministry. But if you're excited to play the games and you're interested in all Use the beginner's things Fix, you want to know, who merely joined us definitely for the ride. stay tuned. I Still? think you guys will enjoy it, and it will set you up very well to play. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Figure all right. Professor Fig and I were lucky to escape with our lives. Indeed. Actually, you know what? We're and Slytherin, so I'm going to do... It's all still a bit of a blur, I'm going to do honest. every chat option mean to press. that I can do you that's, just get like, yourself settled. appropriate we for can a Slytherin talk more now. Later. It was nice meeting you, Sebastian. I'll let you get back to your book. Nice meeting you, too. Good luck today. This room... This is just one common room, and there's four of these. That's kind of creepy. Does anyone know what that is? I'm not actually sure what that is. Is it just a is it just a statue of like a mermaid? But why is it so small? Wait, did this chest just play itself? Play. It What's going on with this some random little chessboard? Is it just playing on its own? No. And it's the same chess set that they used in the movies. I've not seen this before. What? He just got outplayed. Okay. I couldn't agree more. I wouldn't do that if I were you. I think I heard one. Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered ominous the common room, Gaunt. I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. Well, we're a Slytherin, so we got to pick all the appropriate options now. Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> You're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. Thank you, Ominous. Did you get Ominous Very is nice blind. to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you guys he was very friendly to us just there. When I was a Gryffindor, he was not very friendly to me. <laughs> You'll lose. Trust me. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, they Check actually me. doing little animations on the chest? Told you. You should have listened to me. Oh, there are some things magic can't are. fix, guys. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day. Taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. We handled it. And I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. <laughs> <laughs> Not uh, ro the roasted. <laughs> Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kogawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Yeah, the characters' faces do look really good. In fact, the, the outfits look really good too. Like, the details on the robes are, are really impressive. Goodbye, Imelda. Nice meeting you. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. I Gotta go see Professor Weasley. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. 
Now, in light of your unique situation, <laughs> joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. That is a Toxie Moxie special, Especially as you'll jacket, be expected right? to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. Guys, remember, if you're enjoying the streams and you would like to see more of them, whether it's new games, old games, or even Monster Hunter, do click the like button down below. It's a great way to show us that you enjoy them. And we'll do more of them if you do. And do put in the comments or in the chat as well if you enjoy them. It is them. a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning. We haven't done that so many that streams on the channel yet, but we have been bringing them back recently. You would be wise so if to you guys want more, just let us know. Exceptionally valuable resource. The houses have different uniform colours. Yes. Yep. We have a green because uh, we did Professor, a chat poll and they chose mean it Slytherin. Keep track of what I'm learning. Perhaps We're on PC Ultra settings. We'll answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. Hmm, what's this? I certainly would have appreciated something like the field I guide when I was open that chest yet. Student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Tell me that isn't the coolest entrance to a common room. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. Uh, intrigued so up. far i'm absolutely loving it the voice acting the graphics the Why sound design cast Revelio on that statue i really also like the combat once the, once the combat clicks provide. for you it feels so satisfying and hearing them shout you know Ex expelliarmus uh levio the pulsar and all the other spells is just is really cool so this is a chest that we uh we have to get open when we have a way to avoid it seeing us with its big eyeball. Revelio. So these guide pages are everywhere. So here we are, we're level one. We've got our, our field guide. Can see the challenges. So doing these challenges will basically unlock different uh, transmog options for us and stuff like that. So if you want to go and do all the collectibles, you can basically unlock some uh, special transmog things. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for of more. Of course, just Slytherin. Like Wasn't that. my choice, Toxie. Inside we did a poll. Of the Chat decided my fate. I, l I love that. I'm not over that entrance. It's so cool. Oh, we got the flu flame up here. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity the to show you how removed. to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find central hall. What's my actual house, though? It's got to be Gryffindor. Have I done at the? Have I done the test? I've done different tests in the past, and I've either got Gryffindor or Ravenclaw. But I prefer Gryffindor. But Ravenclaw's the common room, and this looks amazing. So here we have the Hogwarts map, and let me tell you guys, Hogwarts is a maze, okay? It's very, it's not that easy to navigate this, and it's sort of one of those things that 
you'll start to learn the layout of the castle the more you play. But there is a, a built-in... Um... Oh, here we go. We're going to fast travel to Central Hall. There is a built-in, like... What would you even call it? Objective guide that you can follow, uh, which I'll show you guys when we have it. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Oh, look at the dragon! Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. I think the voice acting is just good on all fronts. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly Lee vague Tonic, you're gonna be a as to the events good preceding you. your arrival, specifically about what happened after the, the Hufflepuff has the most cozy color room. It's like My our little hobbit My suspicion is that there's hobbit more hole. to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem what platform to have is this? We are on a PC a Ultra settings. In the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic. You see the seems. flying page in the mm. background? I want to go collect well, it. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig? But the early to access for the game will be available tomorrow with map. the deluxe edition for those wondering. Thank you. That's Good the luck thing. Today. Um, and remember to use your Jabberwocky, field guide. there is it will be a lot to you. of famous and invaluable to me. Families, if you like, from, from the law uh, that you're going to encounter yes, Professor. Come and find me in my of course, classroom with the headmaster being a serious as well. Classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Nathan, so far, it is magical. I, I, graphically sound, gameplay, voice acting. Uh, I just, I can't wait for you guys to see more of the castle and like when you get to the open world and you can fly around. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade uh, I think evade Professor Fig Professor is Weasley's well known at this point. Regarding our late arrival? I think what it is is that, you know, there's just been... A, mi a ministry official has just died to the dragon, uh, and and F Professor Weasley is like the the deputy headmistress, and she can kind of tell that she's not been g given all the details. But Fig has his own reasons for not sharing them. I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Yes, Good. you can fly. Now, yes, you can as swim. Capable as but you the are, swimming isn't super I believe fleshed out. The ability you possess you just, like, obliges the you to be well trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. 
speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. So, our field guide can guide us to, like, different quests, right? Uh, so here you can see here, we're also going to get assignments that will give us new spells. And some of the main missions will be locked until you get those new spells. So, shall we go to Defense Against the Dark Arts to get Levioso? Or to Charm Class with Professor Ronan and get Accio? I think we gotta go to the... We're Slytherin, right? We gotta go to the Defense Against the Dark Arts class first. The map is enchanted We're about to an help hour you find your way. Hour and this will be incredibly helpful, game, roughly. thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. I think we gotta go to this dark arts class and get, get Levioso. So if you get lost, you can basically mark something, like your quest, and instead of using the map, which is not gonna lie, quite hard to navigate, you can basically press up. And it will shoot a page out of your book, and that will basically guide you there. Oh, do you see a you see that little page over here? Revelio. So these pages are everywhere. But they're kind of worth it. They're worth getting when you see them, because they do give you XP. And it does add up. All right, let's do Dark Arts class, guys. Our first class at Hogwarts. Is that all you've got? Professor Hecket! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in Eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. You can use Not keyboard and mouse, much. but for me personally, I feel like the game plays to better wise, on controller. To age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised uh, opponent uh, is a weak roasting. opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? Oh, we're One get thing to I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. Yo, we got it, let's go. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. Leviosa. Well, this is Leviosa, guys. It's just slightly different. But we do get Wingardium Leviosa now, later. let's try something a little larger. Let us begin with a basic cast. So. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first. So enemies will have the these cast. these like Protego Remember, shields that are color a surprised coordinated. Opponent is a weak opponent. So with a yellow one, we want to do as a yellow spell such as Levioso. So Levioso. Well done. 
Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> There's so I many references and little touches that you'll recognize from the books so and the movies. 100%. And Protego. You may begin. Let's just say I'm a Get roasted, Sebastian. Stupid Get roasted. I knocked him off the table. Bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. Oh, we let the little two chuff there. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and Kristen they Wright. must achieve it. Don't underestimate the though. A classroom duel is one thing. But battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas Do for I you. The house? Yeah, I Again. did a chat poll, well so chat today. voted for I Slytherin. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. My other playthrough was Gryffindor. All right, that's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. All right, don't roast. We're, we, only just, we only just came to Hogwarts. Why are, you, why are she roasting? I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. Yes, yeah, so... It was certainly good practice. That's true, exactly. Practice. Felt so weakening like enemies an by expert. levitating them, pushing them over, to be so freezing them. The wand. Then again, uh, expel the armor system, stuff like that, will make duel. them take more damage from your basic attacks. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Classic Slytherin enough. banter. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Exclusive oh, and do unsanctioned. Dueling, I think. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If it's you not want Daniel to get the voice, but it does sound very Hogwarts, similar. I think that's why they chose You're it. going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Just don't get caught. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll the see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Classic Look Slytherin. for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Yeah, you can brew potions. Till you can next grow time. plants for ingredients. Later on, in the Room of Requirement, you can capture monsters to look after, creatures, as well as for mounts. You can fly on your broom. You drooled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. Look at this. I, all right, I love this animation. I just want to show it to you guys. I just love the way the page flies away and leaves the trail. How's it going, Sock? I love the way the knights, like, have, have animations as you go past. Alright, we're going to charm class next. And then we might go do Professor some unsanctioned dueling. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't necessarily want It has been a while, so it's great to see you, man. How have you been? How's performance on PC? So I'm playing at 1440p on ultra settings, Behind so you. maxed out. Uh, but I'm streaming to you guys here. at 1080p. Thank you. I think the performance is definitely Hello, taking a hit Nettie. here and there from the streaming so of the game. The In my personal playthrough, I didn't get really Runner? many issues <clears throat> at all. 
uh, but we already have had a few issues here on the stream today, which Shall I would contribute to the stream, but... <laughs> Welcome to year five of Charm. There's the odd now, frame drop. This will you know? be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of feels such alive. a the whole, challenge. I have to agree. Right. Now, everyone, so please much open of it your textbooks feels alive. to page five one seven. But and there's so much begin, to explore. Can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Uh, 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 I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing oblivion on one another. I think it was 3080, <laughs> I think. It might be a 3090. Uh, I, I can't actually remember off the top of my head, but I think it's a 3080. Even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need Where's of the you. Need it right? <laughs> Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blood are objects people, so Harry believe they are. So the game is set in the 1800s, so it's long before, hands. long before one another's hands. Long before Only the, one book the will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. But there's so many references and tidbits that you'll pick up on if you know all about the Wizarding World. We're gonna get Akio. Akio! That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, Potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough we of that. the spell first well, time. as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. I definitely think you don't need to know about the Harry Potter books, movies, or even the Wizarding World. I think the game will still have a lot to offer you. But I will say, if you are a fan of the Wizarding World stuff, there's so much in here that's going to appease you. <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the oh, Quidditch this players is a amongst mini -game. us would agree. I forgot hmm? about this. <laughs> So, oh, this is kind of cool, actually. Yeah. And you can do this as well later on, and like compete in the leaderboard. The summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> Professor's shelling off again. <laughs> so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Huh? 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 So for this, we're going to use Akio to pull Very simply, these balls, Akio on and one of the, the closer to us, the higher the score. Your charm at the last Akio. Now, excellent control there. Come on! Oh, close. You know what we could do though? Oh, do some physics. That's it. Let's go. No, 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 no! Oh, do the best so of close. Us. That's alright, that Very was a practice good. round Points anyway. To Slytherin. Didn't count. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? By the Come way, guys, if you don't know me, I am Paradise. I've been part of the Arctic Gaming channel for about five or six Beauty years. Blues, You've probably before, watched Miss a few Onai, hundred of, hundred of my videos great. over the last Clear? few years. Yes, sir. So if you do enjoy the streams, it will it will probably be me that will be here uh, doing the streams as well for you guys. But if you do enjoy them, make sure to click like. We do go off the likes to uh, to know if you guys enjoy these. Wow, that she's hitting the done. 50 points on the first one. Can I knock it off? Do you think I can just... i got to try this, guys. I'm going to try and knock... Akio. Knock her one off. 
Yo, yo, yo. Stay, 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 stay. You are not oh. making this easy for me, are you? Watch this. Guys, that's how we do it right there. Brutal. I'm going to try it again. Let's try it again. Yes. Manuel, that's right. Yes. Love me to switch deck. Oh, I think I did it. I did it too too powerful. Oh no, is it gonna be 50? So I have to just I have to I think I've won I've won anyway. I've won anyway. We did some Slytherin tactics, guys. Slytherin tactics took a took off took off her uh, her score. So you can actually play this mini game later on, like for a leaderboard. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Do the houses change stuff you can learn? Uh, what do they do? So it changes the common room you're in, as well as like any uh, robes that are to do with your like <laughs> house insignias well and colors. Interesting at this point. Outside of that, you can still learn all the same Enough spells and stuff. It, you know, there's minor different interactions with people and stuff this like that that you'll have to. But it's not going to be like game breaking if you've chosen, you know, a house and it's locking you out of content. You cheated? No, it was in, oh, no, no, it was no cheating. It was in the rules. It's the Slytherin way. Oh, these ones come. These ones like fly. The, the, there is not the same speed on these ones. I feel like I'm getting blocked here. Yes! I'm gonna have to like thread the needle. Okay. Uh I'm gonna try and thread the needle. Not exactly your typical lesson, is it? It's not that easy. You have to really prematurely let go. Quite impressive. Watch this. Oh, is it going to hit the thing? No. Did it push it over? No, it didn't. Okay. Oh, that was close. Uh... No, 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 no. Yes, yes. Yo, we got all on 50. A perfect score. Perfect score. Remarkable. I did not get a perfect score on my first playthrough, guys. I feel like I had a little advantage there. Very good, both of you. Well done. Class is dismissed. That was a fun. I'm not going to lie, guys. I enjoyed that mini game. That was fun. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right Smurfing, when I transferred right? here. <laughs> it gets easier, I promise. Paradise thinks he's Gryffindor, but his heart lies in Slytherin. Oh no. Maybe you're right. Maybe I am a Slytherin. I need to take the quiz again. Thank you, but I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. There is a level up system. Oh, I just wish I could show here. you it. We're not going to be able to my progress far enough for me to show you it, but divination here. Before we'll I have met, a guide out later today. Uganda so stay tuned on the channel. The world, and I'm going to... It's, it's going to explain everything that you want to know. And it will go over that as well. Uh, Batoli. So stay tuned for that. It will answer all your questions. And trust me, there, is, there are levels. There are uh, You spend your, your, your talent points... Upgrades your spells, all kinds of stuff. Well, it's been nice talking and competing with you. And with you. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Uh, Juicy? Of course. Joshi? It's going to be uh, tomorrow for the deluxe early access. If you're so inclined. 
Well, you'd be using it to How far into the game until you make your wand? It's a couple you hours in. in word, if you would. It will be in your first play session if you play for like, you know, a few hours. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well managing to best exactly. as Once gifted you go to a student exactly. as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the Fair ordinary enough, totally curriculum. Get it. That's what we're Expect here for, though, so you can, you can see if you like it, you know, special see, what's, see what's up with the game. I am preparing for you. And I, I've finished the game. We've, we have finished the game on the channel already, so... It's, it's interesting. I think... I really think fans of the Wizarding World are going to love this game. That, that would be my biggest, like, takeaway from playing. What's this guy doing over here? Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a bit mad. After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant Accio this, Accio that, cutlery flying everywhere. Quite unsafe. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Hello. That's right. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. How in depth is the one customization? So when you get to it in Hogsmeade, you can basically choose the appearance. And there's, I can't remember the exact number. I want to say maybe like seven or eight different appearance options. And they're all quite widely different. Then you can choose like the type of wood. So like the color of it. Um, you can also choose the, the main ingredient of the wand between dragon heart I think like phoenix feather unicorn horn or something like that and then you can also change the length of it thank you but it really wasn't all that challenging my brother will do the slither and chat so options every time to trust your abilities then again he tends to be a bit overconfident in his well better see to my charms homework I find Professor Ronan's lessons a bit more challenging than you do. There's another chest up here. Revelio. Oh, it's like, it must be a floor above. Whoa, what's this guy doing? Okay. So, let's see, what, where do we, what do we have next? Oh, we got some side quests available now. Okay, well, we might as well... Wait, do you think we should go... Should we go do some jeweling? Let's do it, let's do it. Let's go to the unsanctioned uh, jeweling uh, club. And we'll follow the uh, the page. I just love the animation when you send the page out. Oh, we got some outside now. Whoa. Who flying around? I think there'll be co-op DLC. I can't really say. I'm not really sure the game is designed for co-op. I think, someone, like someone said earlier, if they ever did a Quidditch DLC, that would be insane. Look at the details of the castle, like even on the outside. Was that one of the... Is that a ghost? 
and so she agreed. Sure, I thought I was hearing something. I thought I feel like I was, there was a ghost back there, but I may have missed it. All right, we're gonna go to this unsanctioned dueling club. Get some battles in. Glad you could make it. Lucan's just over there. Oh, so here's something to share with you guys. So around the castle, obviously we have Revelio. like the Revelio to reveal things. So the, these statues, you'll find a bunch of these around. So once you have Levioso, Levioso, you can open it up and collect the new page. So if you see those statues, hit them with a Levioso. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. How long did it take you a approximately? Club of sorts. If you only do knows, main so missions you and you really don't explore Sebastian. and you don't do side quests, it's going to be about 20 hours. If you want to do side quests and explore, I think you could easily go to 60, 80, maybe 100 hours. So it depends on how you want to play. But I, I, th I don't think it's very easy to just do only main missions because there's so much to go and explore. And you'll miss out on a lot. But it's, it, it, you know, it depends how you want to play. I seem to have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does Cross Wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? The pages give you XP, but they're also like a collectible. And there's challenges to collect like, you know, certain milestones, amounts of them. And they will give you like special transports. Of course, dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Crossroads, Any meta build you can yet? deal with a partner if you like. I mean, there probably the is, but to be honest, like... Sebastian. As long as you're Next juggling time, enemies, you'll need to bring a you can along, mix and match and combo alone. things how you like. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! You could definitely just fly around and go and explore and, and gather things we'll and make do encounters. Like all around the, uh, the overland area. Alright, let's do this. Oh, I got I got clobbered. Okay. Ha only having the first two spells. Makes it a little tricky. Oh, he Sebastian's got Confringo? So your stupefy counter attacks will also break the, the Protego covered shield. I did get hit a little bit there. Sebastian wasn't wrong about Well played to them. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. There we go. We did the first challenge. Can we do that? There is more challenges. I'm wondering if we can do them straight away or not. I think, I think we might have to come back later to do the other challenges. Look at the size of that armor. Who's wearing that? All right, so. Oh, I can show you guys the gear as well now. So, as you can see, we basically have six gear slots. So if I just fill out my uh, my gear slots, make sure we got everything that we want. So, we have the six gear slots, right? These will contribute towards our defense and offense stats. So, so our starter gear, like for example, this scarf, it doesn't have any stats on it, but as we go through, we're gonna get stats on these gears. And then in the later game, you're gonna get traits on the gears that will uh, buff you in different ways. But the coolest thing is, all of these gear slots can be transmogged at any time for free. 
So here's an example. Uh, I've, I've done the pre-registration on the Wizarding World website, so I have the House Fanatic robes. So I can rep Slytherin in style now, as you can see. Uh, I've also got the Dark Arts pack, so I'm going to have some extra Transmog goodies too, such as this sort of, uh, what's it called, like the Dark Arts garrison hat here, which has a sort of animation on it. Uh, I think part of the Dark Arts pack we also get this really scary mask, but another one from the pre-registration, uh, we get the beaked mask. To be honest, I'm not a fan of the masks, so I'm gonna just have I'm just gonna have my glasses. We'll just keep the glasses on. Uh, for the gloves, we can go with the Dark Arts gloves. They just have a little bit more detail than those basic ones that we had. And our clothes underneath, we've also got the the Dark Arts clothes. It just gives us some nice looking. You can't really see too much underneath. Depend so depending on what robe you have. Your under underclothes don't come into play too much, but you can get capes and things, and that does let you see your your outfit a lot easier. Uh, but if we wanted to go full dark arts, we could go with this one. This is pretty Slytherin, actually. It's pretty not. I'm trying to think. Do we want to we want to rock the the Slytherin colors with the snake on the back, or the dark arts pack with the skulls on it? Maybe we go the dark arts actually. I'm feeling the Dark Arts pack right now as a Slytherin. Now we look. Now we look ready. Ready to do some Dark Arts. So, we can open up the map, and we can see my main quest here is to go and talk to Professor Weasley, right? So the way that traveling the map works is we have these different flags which indicates like different wings of Hogwarts, right? So we could just run through the castle but we can also click the flag nearest to where you want to go. So I don't have any of the fast travel points, the flu flames here, but I do have one here. So I can select that and I can basically fast travel here. And you can do this from anywhere. So you don't have to go to a fast travel point to fast travel. You can just do it from anywhere in the game, even out in the open world. So you can very easily get to where you need to go like quickly. Like you don't have to fly around if you don't want to. You don't have to run through. But there is some... Some nice immersion if you do that. Uh, oh, hello. And yeah, you can pet the cat. <laughs> There's cats around the place. It's not just this one. Go do the next quest, shall we, guys? Yeah, lots of quality of life there. What about the though. room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse me. The drip, Dick. right? Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professor's this is PC Hecate version Roman. on Ultra Settings. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Nothing more, got Professor. A... I see. We I'm gotta trying keep to get our a sonic Professor from a Fig safe. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Extra assignments? More work? I'm not sure I have time for extra assignments, Professor. You shall find the time. You'd be astonished to know just how much you don't know. In fact, Professor so the Roman game launches will meet on the you 10th, outside momentarily. But tomorrow to on the 7th one. is the now, early the access with the deluxe Hogsmeade edition. I mentioned earlier. We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, we can and go to Hogsmeade. Crafts. Thank you, Professor. And That's Mr. The next. Ollivander I think that might be the next will connect you with the perfect wand. And we can customize you've managed our wand. your glasses well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. I'm ready. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Let's take Sebastian there. Slytherin's got to stick I'd together. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. 
Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard, and he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid Guys, if you're enjoying the stream, the gameplay, right hand the reactions, the rundown, of course, as I played this uh, already, Once you've finished Professor then you can show support to us by clicking your like. Will meet you at the castle and doors. if you guys enjoy no this, time to waste. we'll do more streams for you as well. I quite enjoy doing the these for you guys. You can enjoy a at the three but we do go off, the, uh, we go off the likes, so if you do want to see more, you got to click that like button. Alright, we gotta go talk to. Oh, our first assignment. We're gonna get Repero. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed, I do. And an exceedingly useful one at that the mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in mm -hmm. an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. All right. I'll start on the task right, right away, Professor. He wants us to collect the flying pages. Revelio. All right. This is the one. Right Got it. We just accioed that page. A flying page must be allowed. Got him. Alright, we're done. That was easy. That's probably the easiest assignment you're going to get, by the way. They, uh, you're not going to do the next ones that quickly. <laughs> I trust the preliminary I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvellous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember right, to be deliberate now. in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember... Your wand we go. is a conduit of your magic. So these uh, wand mini games actually do get a little bit harder later on in the game. Different inputs and stuff. But well, they're not too difficult once you get the grip of it. So now we can basically repair things that are broken. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken an statue in the alcove Repair. by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate. Pretty cool, right? Out. Oh, we're nearly level four already. So, I think is our next quest to like meet Sebastian head out to Hogsmeade <gasps> it is oh I want to do this guys we gotta I gotta show you guys Hogsmeade Revelio. wait did we not do we do this one already Levioso. Ooh, I guess it's a different one little collectible there little page collectible I am getting some frame drops, by the way, but I am contributing it a bit towards the fact that I'm streaming because I wasn't getting frame drops quite like this when I was playing without streaming. Check this out. Really creepy. Rebellion. The General Hall Fountain. So there's a side quest here. What am I missing? Which is actually, that's a pretty cool one, to be honest. So that will teach you about what these uh, these frames are. But well, uh, we won't do that now. We're going to head to Hogwarts. Uh, Hogsmeade now instead. Oh, guys. Guys, guys, guys. All right. Here's a little tip for you, right? If you're here, there's a tip for you, okay? So when you're at the, the central hall, 
and you cut you face this doorway and you go left okay so you could you could very easily just run past like this right very easily but over here look little secret okay let's have a chest little secret there you go little gear upgrade for you so now now you know and then look you can get some extra stats Oh, we're not high enough level yet? Level 5? Well, you know. You'll have it for when you level up. <laughs> Alright, Hogsmeade is... Oh yeah, someone was asking about the ghosts. So here, there, the, there are more of the ghosts throughout the castle. Even ones that you will recognise. If you followed the uh, the books or the movies, Ooh, the same. so you've got to keep an eye out for them, and there will be various interactions with them as well. Well, fancy meeting you here. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. Well, I haven't left not the very happy since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavour to be the very best of guides then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place, self-contained too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? All right, we're off to Hogsmeade now. There's so many shops in Hogsmeade, by the way. Dame, that's right, he is. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. I think, does this mission... As this am mission I. might... Thank I you, by the way. I think just time of day is of just course. constantly moving. You're the only one who's ever Because I'm pretty sure... The way I when see I did this it, part be before, it was, you. like, different weather. So that's kind of cool. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor oh, would trust me with anything, pitch over given there. my detention record. I spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well-rounded. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. <laughs> Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince the over design compared to NPCs. To be. Yeah, so most people have regular school robes on, uh, but I've put the the dark arts pack on, which is very fancy, as you can see. But you know what? Maybe we should do a little. Let's do a little mix up. Let's put the house fanatic robes on. I think we can keep most. Let's keep most things the same. But you know what? I will get rid of the hat, and we can just look more, more like a Hogwarts student. So, how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lace Ah, oh, some resource gathering. Look, if you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Oh god, you gotta stew the fireflies. Or the lace wing flies, I should say. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look! What's going on? See for yourself. Quite a hippogram. Sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Do you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all Ooh. students. Oh, the hence the name. Forest. Precisely. They it's very it's tempting, dangerous. isn't it, guys? I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. 
Mr. Zombie, I think if you want to platinum this game, it's going to take a fair few hours. I would probably estimate between 60 and 80, maybe. Maybe more. Depends how effective you are and how quick you are at you uh, much of a chance you know, to explore the castle? clearing and, get, and getting a little, the collectibles and stuff. It's positively enormous. The leaping it toad stalls? I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Loads to see, places to discover. Oh? Whoa. Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. I've always thought Thestral's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. Or we go down but to the you lake. can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a Oh, yeah, we get some. Uh, uh, is it Moonstones, I think? Most notably, that dragon attack. Hopefully, we'll the need rest a lot of Moonstones later on for the Room of Requirement. So when you see those, I would recommend uh, going out of your way and gathering them. Oh, a little cat. Actually, now is the perfect time. I want to show you guys uh, Lumos again. So listen to the sound effect, okay? Lumos. Love it. Mr. Moon. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. We're Moon. About not being able to unlock all of the towns. Yes, so it's Pleasure. an interesting choice, right? Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, I don't mind it too much. Run. I feel like it makes you think about Is what you're investing right, in more. Oh, look right at me! Oh, and there's definitely a few perks soldiers. that personally I'm like, oh, I'm not really interested what in that did, anyway. Mr. Moon. So, Demi, guys, ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Demi, guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much old. of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Here we go. Oh, is your sister in We've made it too. to Hogsmeade. She is. Or rather, she was. Revelio. Well, Peach here too. But she'll be better soon and back up. Another cat? They're everywhere. Honestly, if one look how cozy this place, this place is. is. I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get. A wand and some other bits. Oh, we got some frame drops yes. there. Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Oh, Perfect. I think we recover. Can't wait to see what you do with the new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. I think we gotta go to get our wand first, Remember, right? Have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Is brimming with different shops, sites, and other points of interest. Oh, should we go to Honey Dukes or should we get our wand? Let's, we gotta get our wand. Let's go to Ollivander's, and then we'll go to Honey Dukes. Merlin's blooming beard, not again. I'll be right with. Ah. It's you. Um, just a moment, please. Shout out to Oliver. Uh, hello, sir. What an iconic shop. For, for a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? Mm, 
No, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes. I thought that we put the one by it. Ten and a half inches? Hmm, you might do. I believe yeah. I have DLSS on. Give this one a try. Uh, Shiv. Ooh, that's a well, nice one. Ahead, swish. Hmm. How odd. Switch and uh, flip. Once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. I love how they have well, this, this whole, like, segment all, in is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Mm. Dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Doesn't look that bad. Oh, 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 oh goodness! Oh, looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. This, yes. I love the sound effects too. It, it doesn't get old. Like the, the there's so many different sound effects for the different spells and Here. stuff. Take it. It's really good sound design. So here we go for our wand customization. So this, I believe, this is the one from my Wizarding World account with the quiz. But you can then, so you like you'll have this one that you could go with, but you could also customize it. So. We got two, four. We got eight customization options. Curious indeed. Pretty interesting. I do like the spiraled one. How intriguing! That's like some classic. I like this one with the little twirl in it too. Curious indeed. Although we are, we you know we are a Slytherin, and then you do have the wood color options as well. So like How this one here, we can slightly change the color. Oh, this one does look like quite a Slytherin one, doesn't it? But this one kind of does too. Curious indeed. I suppose this one as well. Try and show you guys a few different color options. Oh, that looks interesting, right? How intriguing. So you can do that then, right? So then we can change the uh, the wood type. So this is kind of like the fluff of the wand, right? So can we make it... Is Elder an option? We can have Curious Elder. Indeed. And then we can make the length like 14 and a half. And we can make it unyielding. And then we can choose the uh, the core. So they all have different like things that they're for. So the uh, the dragon heart string is like producing powerful magic. Uh, the unicorn hair is consistent, and the phoenix feather is for like a great range of magic. I'm not I got, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I don't know if these actually change anything or if it's like the fluff for your wand. But uh, I think a dragon, dragon heart string wand is most powerful. There we and go. Learns quickly. So then we can look at our our recap here. Should we go? I think we'll go for this one. So you do have a lot what of good options you there that you can do. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> Ah. You change one to one later? You know, I never, I haven't actually now, checked that. Maybe we can check this feel? now. Good. Different. I sense the sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. 
A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Yeah, so the 20 hours as a linear story, I, I want to emphasize it's really only doing main missions and the submissions required for the main missions. And that's if you just like beeline everything. So if you know you want to do the odd side quest here or there, or you might want to go off and explore, it's going to be more than that. Oh, a chest. So, are we able to go back in and just interact as a shot? Ah, oh, it doesn't look like we can now. I'm not. I'm not sure if we can customize this one later on. I'm really not sure because I haven't actually checked. So, I think next, there's obviously other shops and things we need to go to for the story, but I want to see if I can show you guys honey tubes. Because it's so it's it's just fun, and it, obviously, if you know the books and stuff, then you're gonna know about honey tubes. We got the Hogsmeade Square, and then here we have honey dukes. Got some, uh, <laughs> got some dancing cotton candy. Look at this place. Oh, don't mind if I do. <laughs> There's so many candies. Rebellion. So this. Is that these are fizzing whizbies. As it says there, they'll make you float. <laughs> is there anything up here? Just looks like a counter. Twist this. Doxy floss. And I think is there anything is that can we eat these down here? Rebellion. So here we have the exploding bonbons. But I don't think we can actually eat these. But there's so many of, you know, the candies that and the different things that uh, you'll recognize from... from the lore. So I think that's pretty, that's pretty much... Oh, what's this? Elephant on a bicycle. Oh wait, there's one, there's, I missed one, there's one over here. I just remembered. We got the pepper imps. I don't know if you guys heard that one, my headphone batteries just got low. Yeah, you can just munch everything for free, they don't seem to mind. But yeah, it's just a bit of fun to just check out Honey Dukes, because there's just some, you know... It's just so vibrant and colourful, and there's a, a bunch of different things that you'll recognise if you've uh, read the books or seen the movies. And there's quite a few more different shops around the place as well. It's actually a really cool quest here that you get later on that uh, you have to wait and see when you play it. What does everyone think of uh, Hogwarts Legacy, though? What do you guys think so far? Those of you that have uh, stuck through or just joined, I'd love to know your guys' opinion, of course. We're going to have a, well, hopefully, really helpful uh, guide coming out on the channel later on that, if you are interested in playing, is going to 
collate all of the tips and stuff that we wish we knew uh, and give it to you guys in a in a nice concise format so you can watch that video and just be like, okay, I know what's up in the game. I'm going in ready, so definitely keep an eye out for that on the channel. This, that starting uh, that starting scene with the dragon as well, that was such a cool way. Play a bit more? Alright guys, we're gonna do a little bit more. Let's, you know, we should just we should just keep doing the main story because there, there might be something... I can't remember exactly what happens next, but there might be something more. But yeah, definitely keep an eye out on the channel for the guide later on. I think you guys... Got him! I think you guys will enjoy it. Uh, so we need to go to the Tomes and Scrolls, J. Pippin's Potions, and the Magic Meat. So, what are we nearest? Uh, we're actually nearest the Potion Shop. Let's head over and grab some, uh, grab some potions. Or are we gonna get some ingredients? There's also, like, all these locked doors that, you're, like, you're not gonna be able to get until later on. Check out this guy with the sign. <laughs> Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Oh, we got a new scarf. I'll take it. Is there a We're page in it? Grab the page, get the XP. You know, you gotta get you gotta get those pages if you want the XP. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, There's so many details in these shops as well. Service. Look, look at all the stuff in the background. J. Pippin's potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? I was even to got to the potion wand, ring yet. Said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? If you're not a fan, it's not desirable. It's good for what it is, but it seems more or less with fans. I think there is definitely an element where it's going to appease the fans more because they're going to have nostalgia with certain things from when they read the books in the past or when they watched the movies, you know, growing up and stuff like that. I do think that at the at its core, the game is very good in a lot of different aspects. It has it has a lot of like scenic places when you're flying around, things to go and do all over the map, a ton of collectibles if you're into collecting things. Obviously, the sound design is really good. The voice acting is there. You've got the overarching story. Going into it without knowing anything about the Wizarding World and all of the Harry Potter stuff, I think will be a bit like you know, you don't really understand what's going on. You don't have an attachment to anything. But I think there's a lot of charm in the game that they've made here. And so even going in without that knowledge, I think once you're a few hours in, you're going to get that feeling of like, wow, there's just so much to explore and go and do and uncover and learn. And you're constantly, constantly learning new spells that not only incorporate into the exploration uh, of the open world and interacting with different objects, but also into the combat, which we haven't even got very far into the combat yet, but the combat gets more interesting the more spells you have. So, personally speaking, I think that there is something there for both people on each side of the fence, the, you know, the diehard fans and the people who have no idea about uh, the lore and the setting. Um, but of course, much like any game that already has a ton of, like, background information, that's out there, it's going to be more appealing to those people. 
so we can get the Edoras potion, which is like the one that gives you like a rock rock skin, like a defense potion, and with the Wigan Weld, which is our basic healing potion. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. And we cannot or afford come back another any time of the others if you're yet. in a rush today. But we can learn. I think there's more. There might be more potions than these as well. Uh, but the Focus potion, Thunderbrew. The Thunderbrew potion is really cool, by the way. Uh, Thunderbrew's been one of my favorite ones to use. It's it's so fun. It makes like a thundercloud follow you around, and it just like does like spectacular lightning strikes on enemies or, like around you periodically. We do have the two of these same items though, and one of them is level four. Uh, notice how both of these items are one is a higher level than the other, but the sell the sell price is the same. So the sell price is tied to the item rarity. It's not really tied to the level or the stats. And you want to just sell your basic gear. So gear, inventory spaces are are going to be a problem, <laughs> which you can upgrade them later on. Uh, but we'll have more info on that in the in the guide and stuff that you guys should watch out for uh, later on on the channel. Let's just have a quick look around though. Like, look, there's just so much detail. Like, this is just one shop in Hogsmeade. Obviously, we went in Honeydukes. You guys saw all the stuff in there. But what really intrigues me is just the amount of detail that's in like most corners, you know, of the different houses, different areas, different corridors of Hogwarts. So if you're someone that really likes exploring and likes, you know, the smaller things, the smaller details, there's there's so much here to see. I love the windows as well. I never actually looked at these windows before. Oh, it's nice. It's got really nice and sunny. So when it's like really sunny like this, when you have your broom, it's so nice to just fly around the place. Uh, we won't. You don't actually get the broom for maybe a couple more hours. So we're definitely not going to be able to get the broom uh, to show that to you guys. So that's our gameplay part one, guys. You now have a pretty good understanding of, you know, the beginning of the game, how it runs and performs obviously my opinions throughout and uh all of that stuff any questions that you guys had through the stream so i hope you guys really enjoyed this again if you do enjoy the streams you can support us by clicking the like button that's what we use as a metric to see if we should do more streams uh but it's really fun interacting with you guys i want to say thank you to everyone that's uh joined and stuck around in chat i hope it's been helpful uh to see the game and make your make your choices based on based on all of that and of course, do click, do stay subscribed and check out the channel because we're going to have some cool stuff coming for you guys over the next few days that you don't want to miss out on. Uh, but that's it for now. So thank you for watching, everybody. And I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>